morning guys it is Monday morning and I decided to try and attempt to do a, another week of vlogging like a week in the life of me this is my cat Kana she usually only loves Doug but she's cuddling with me this morning oh look at that so yeah because I'm gonna have a relatively busy week if if the weather stays okay, it's been snowing a lot and I don't really like to drive in the snow because I live in the mountains so the roads are icy and snowy and it's scary and I hate it. But um, today first we have, usually I film on Mondays but I don't really have a special guest set up quite yet so that has to wait. Um, so first off I gotta take my dog Nevaeh to the vet because I have reason to believe that they didn't perform her hysterectomy correctly so she got fixed when she was a puppy like not a puppy but you know as soon as she can get fixed back when she was younger because she's five now she got fixed or she's six no she was born in 2013 she's five so um she got fixed then but I've noticed her going into heat anyway and I thought maybe some dogs like went into fake heat like I've heard of like a mock heat but I'm not sure but um we just got her a white dog bed and she's always had dark dog beds because she has black fur so like dark and then you know it wouldn't look too messy with her fur if she had a dark bed but I wanted to get her a white one because it just looked really nice and it was really soft and it fit perfectly in her kennel and now I'm noticing like red in her kennel and during her like fake heat time because she like swear I swear she goes through these fake heats but she's bleeding so like that's not good so we're going to the vet today to try to figure out what's up and then I'm gonna go to the post office see if I got any vape mail maybe visit my grandma I don't know today's kind of just a chill day usually it is my my busy day but for filming but like I said I'm not filming so we'll see I'll just I'm just gonna take you guys along for the ride it is a uh, it's seven in the morning right now I didn't sleep too well had a terrible, terrible nightmare. Like, one of the worst nightmares I've ever had in my life. Um, so, about, like, demon four-year-olds killing people that I loved. So, yeah, let's uh, let's get this day going. I'm going to have some breakfast. Are we at the vet? Are you stressed? You don't like the vet, huh? Such a good girl. Yeah. You can be a good girl. So we're done with the vet. Maybe it has to have some blood work done. I'm just gonna get a coffee for my mom before I stop by at my mom's work and say hi to her since I'm in town. All right, we're home now. So I'm gonna go ahead and watch some Netflix while I walk on my treadmill. Smart. Okay. okay, good morning guys. So yeah. I haven't vlogged for a while, so I kind of have to get back into the swing of it. I didn't do so well yesterday, <laughs> vlogging everything. I don't really have much planned today other than I'm going to like film a little bit. I'm going to get on my treadmill. I'm going to have a chiropractic appointment today, but yesterday was like more exciting <laughs> than today is going to be. And then tomorrow I feel like is going to be even more uh, boring, not boring, but like it feels like each day I only have one really important thing to do. Like yesterday, the important thing was taking my dog to the vet. Today, the important thing is my chiropractic appointment. Tomorrow, I have a massage. Thursday, I have another chiropractic appointment. Um, and then Friday, I don't really have anything planned Friday yet. So, yeah, uh, it is Tuesday morning. And I'm going to try harder to make the vlog a little bit better I don't know I did film I did vlog a whole week once before I think it turned out okay and you guys seem to enjoy it so I'm attempting that again but I like I said I haven't vlogged in so long I'm trying to think of the last time that I vlogged might have been my trip to Idaho which was like 
October of last year. So it's been a long time since I attempted vlogging, guys. So yeah, I'm just I just woke up. I'm just laying on the couch, being lazy, checking my phone, my emails, eating breakfast. I had a yogurt, an Activia yogurt probiotic, and um, a little mandarin orange. And I'm thinking about maybe having a piece of peanut butter toast because I love me some peanut butter. Um, and then I'm gonna get on my treadmill and watch some Netflix. Right now I'm watching Bates Motel. The verdict is still out on what I think about that. It's a little, it's it's weird, but like I can't stop watching, so we'll see. All right guys, so my headache didn't really go away. I've had a headache since I woke up. And I'm not gonna run on my treadmill for an hour or do any sort of physical activity because that'll just make my headache work worse. I didn't drink enough water yesterday is probably what the culprit is. Um, so instead, I'm foregoing the exercise at the moment to do all these dishes. Because I do not have a dishwasher, I have to do them by hand still. Yup, gonna let these bitches dry right here until I put them away. So the dishes are done, and now, before I take a shower, I am going to watch the rest of the newest Walking Dead episode because I fell asleep on Sunday watching it because it was a hour and a half long episode and I go to bed early, and so yeah, I passed out in the middle of it. I gotta finish watching the end of a sad episode. I've already had spoilers, but I already knew it was coming, so. This is my favorite facial wash ever. All right guys, I'm out of the shower. Now I'm gonna research a little bit about the products I'm looking at this week. I'm checking out the Sorin Drop, the Kilo 1K Ultra Portable System, and, oh, yes, I am legal smoking age, the Iron Fist by UL. And done. Okay guys, wow, look how red my cheeks still are from the hot shower. I don't know why my face does that every time. Um, I have finished looking up all the stuff that I need to for the stuff that we're looking at this week. Now I'm gonna go open and film the close-ups that I do for each device. And I'm not actually filming the like FaceTime or special guest video yet today, so that'll be tomorrow. Wondering, this is how I do my close-ups with my old Canon G7X right here. Check it out, sneak peek. So I finished my close-ups. I have an hour and a half till my chiropractic appointment, but I have to leave, you know, with, I have to, it takes me like 40 minutes to get there since I live out in the middle of nowhere. So I'm gonna go ahead and put just a little bit of makeup on since I'm going out in public and I wanna scare everyone. And then um, probably just relax and watch some Netflix. I really wanted to get on the treadmill this morning, but my head is, still pounding so I might just wait maybe after my adjustments at my chiropractor my my head will feel better I'm chugging water so we'll see it's still my goal for today Ooh, oh excuse me Ooh, bless me okay guys so I'm heading into town actually a little bit early because my mom is gonna go with me to my chiropractic appointment like well she's not going to the appointment with me but afterwards we're gonna do a little bit of shopping and then probably come back and probably gonna film a video with her so heading into town to go to, well, I'm gonna check my PO box first and then go to her work and um, pick her up and we'll go to town together, okay.
vlogging. You're vlogging. Mm -hmm. So guys, I am back as you can see. I went to town with my mom. We did my chiropractic appointment. We went shopping. We went to Old Navy, Ulta, Zabora, got some stuff. And then we went to Panda Express because my stepdad has never had that. So she went and got some to bring home to him. And now I'm back and I am filming for today's video, which I will have a special special guest, which you guys will have already seen by the time this vlog goes up. But um super excited for you guys to meet this new special guest. Alright, good morning guys. It's Wednesday morning and I just had some breakfast. Honey bunches of oats with almond breeze, almond milk, and um going to just relax this morning, watch some YouTube videos in my subscription box, and then head to my massage. Okay, so I am <clears throat> on my way to my massage, and it is 100% gonna snow. And even though I lived here my whole life, I hate driving in the snow, and because I live like out, up in the mountains, like it's even worse for me, and then I have to drive down into town <sighs> to do anything or go anywhere. You know, I live about 15 minutes from the nearest stoplight, and that's just, that's not even, like, town town. Can I just please hold out the snow for uh, an hour and a half? Because I have a one-hour massage at 9, and it's, it's 8.30. So, I'm going to head out now. I'm tired this morning. I did not sleep well that all our neighbor's dog was barking in the middle of the fucking night. We have these new neighbors that don't give a shit about anyone else. And they let their dogs run around and shit in everyone's yard and bark all hours of the night, chase my friend's chickens and attack my friend's chickens. I have a friend who lives up here too. And it's annoying and then I had heartburn and that was keeping me up. Anyways, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go and get the show on the road. Probably not gonna vlog on the way into town like I did the other day because the road's probably a little bit slick today. I'm back in the changing room. There's like bathrooms. This place is so nice. There's like a shower in it. That's my tote with my robe in it. My stuff. Me. Super nice. Got my nice comfy robe on. Alright, let's go to the relaxation room. Alright guys, just got out of my massage. It was so nice. I'm like so sleepy now. Maybe I should get the massage in the evening. So now I gotta go home. <laughs> Grace my hairs. Now I gotta go home and get ready to film. I am gonna stop by the P.O. box, see if there's any vape mail there just since I'm in town. Usually I only check it like once a week, but I'm in town and they like left me this little chocolate in my room to have. It looks really yummy. I'm gonna try it later because I got my teeth in and don't have anything to brush my teeth with but um yeah I'm so tired that felt so good oh and I had such a knot in this shoulder like I don't even think she was able to work oh wow I don't know if you guys heard that I don't know if she was able to work it all out in the time because it was just an hour long but oh, that was amazing I don't know why I don't do this more often I think the last time I had a sweetest Swedish massage was last year when I took Doug and I to get a couple's massage, so I think I should go more frequently because I feel so freaking good. Alright, I'm gonna get out of here. Still have to film. I have a special, a new special guest coming over to film a couple videos with me today. Nothing in the P.O. box. Stopped by and said hi to my mom. And get ready. My special guest is gonna be at my house in a little over two hours. Oh, I'm sorry, I just had my things stuck in the bowl. 
Alright, let's go. Alright guys, I am at home. I got my face on. I did something to my hair. I'm gonna change it. But I'm going to film. Got my camera ready. Got my like quick lights up. I know I, I have these lights, but I am too lazy. This room's too small. So I just use my quick lights because I can just bring them close easy. But I'm about to film. Uh, today's video will be the favorites video for February. Like I have no idea when you guys are going to see this vlog. But um, yeah, and so I'm gonna film that by myself and then I should have have a special guest over to help me film a couple of vape videos and my mom's also coming over to film a Sephora video with me but yeah I don't think I need to change my hair I don't know it's like not washed it's flare up. just filmed with my mom oh, and she's Francis. currently watching the video back before I edit it <laughs> My mom has left. We finished our Sephora filming and she rewatched it. She likes to rewatch it right after we're done filming before I edit it and put it up. Um, my special guest isn't here yet and I was supposed to hear, they were supposed to be here about half an hour ago and they called earlier this morning to change the time of when they were coming to a few hours later and I said that was fine. And then I messaged them a little bit before the time they were supposed to be here and I asked, like what was up and I haven't heard from them and they haven't looked at the message and now they are half an hour late so I really really hope that they show up so update I heard from my special guest thank goodness and it's snowing outside you all the snow it's been snowing for a while now so my special guest is on their way I'm just going to fix up the room a little bit because it kind of got messy when my mom was here moving stuff around I'm gonna set that up get my lights in order I'm excited that they're here or that they're coming I was worried you gonna vlog right there yeah why I don't want to get up I'm tired and I forgot to vlog when Amanda was here Okay guys, so my special guest left and I don't know if you can even see me right now. Doug's over there. Just relaxed on the couch, had dinner, had spaghetti, and now we're watching the Frankenstein Chronicles on Netflix. We just started episode one, so the verdict on my opinion on it is still out. I don't even know, you probably, <laughs> probably won't be able to see me, but too tired to get up <laughs> hey guys good morning it is Thursday morning it is still dumping snow outside and I have a chiropractic appointment today it's at 11 but to get there on time with as slow as I'm gonna have to drive I'm gonna have to leave at least like an hour and a half early cuz oh my god I don't even actually my roads not even plowed that's how in the mountains I live my road isn't even plowed it's it's uh, 8.15 now, I got up at like 6.30 this morning, just got up early, because it was so bright outside from all the snow. So I'm just gonna spend my morning um, answering some emails, I got a lot of emails, and looking at comments, and answering comments. And um, I had, what did I eat for breakfast? <laughs> Honey bunches of oats, strawberries, and almond milk, and I had an Activia yogurt, and a mandarin orange, so it's like my go-to, my favorite type of breakfast. I like yogurt and fruit and cereal. I'm recently liking cereal, if that's a new thing. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna try to call when my chiropractic appointment place opens and switch my appointment, hopefully to like four o'clock. By then, I'm hoping it, maybe the snow has slowed down. And also, my mom has a doctor's appointment, so she I could ride with her, and you know she's way more experienced than the snow driving, obviously, because she's my mom and she's 20 years older than me. Um, but my freaking back hurts. Like it doesn't hurt. Like the muscles aren't in pain. They're sore from the massage yesterday, and they started getting sore last night. And I'm like, wow, that's crazy, because I had like a huge knot in my right shoulder that I didn't even know there was a knot there, but it was huge. And I don't even think she was able to rub it out in the time that I had, because it was just an hour long massage. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna basically spend my morning answering emails, and if I can change my appointment time, I'm gonna go ahead and jump on the treadmill for today and watch some Netflix while I walk a couple miles and also, what else was I going to say? Oh, I'm going to spend all day packing. So it's not going to be a very fun day. Like 
if I have anything to vlog, it'll be me going to my chiropractor and going to my mom's appointment, paying my mortgage, and trying to return something to Target that does not fit. So, that's all I have besides packing today. My husband's out snow blowing so he can get his work truck out, even though I don't know if he's even going to be able to drive down the road because he's actually using a rental work truck right now, and they, they gave him a work truck because his normal work truck is being worked on, and this rental that they gave him doesn't even have snow tires. And I'm like, for where we live, are you kidding me? No snow tires? So it's completely dangerous for him to be driving this type of weather. And I'm just like staring out the window, just watching the snow just dump and thinking like how dangerous it is because he drives across state, like all of the um, western side of Washington. And today he's going pretty far and I'm like, wow, he has to drive in this weather like so far. And I'm so worried because I don't want him to like get in an accident because the vehicle he has does not have the appropriate tires. And I don't know why his, his job is okay with that because if anything should happen to him, then it's on them, right? I mean, it better be. I don't know. I think I'm going to call his boss and complain. Look at my look at my baby hair. <laughs> oh my god, they're so bad. This is like hair that grew back after I stopped bleaching my hair. And it's not long enough to reach the top ponytail that I put my hair in when I go to bed because it's too freaking hot on my neck when I sleep. Anybody else do that? I don't do it all the time because then it does create breakage. But when we have the heat cranked up because it's winter time, girl needs her hair off her neck. All these emails to answer. Mm. No. <laughs> I wish it would stop. I'm at the chiropractic office. I get to get in that thing every time. But you know, my back hasn't gone out in a whole month. So that's progress, I think. Verdict is still out. Maybe like three months of chiropractic work. And if it doesn't go out, thumbs up. Okay, so I successfully paid my mortgage payment for this month. And oh my God, when I was in the bank, there was this kid there. Had to be like six or seven. Was not listening to his mom was running around the bank freaking sitting in chairs like you know at the bank cubicles and stuff <laughs> like was um was not listening to anybody else like telling him like oh you probably shouldn't sit there and even when the lady hang on catch my breath <laughs> even when the lady that sits and that's her desk came there he wouldn't move and his mom like ran over there and drug him back to the teller to tell her where she was standing and getting serviced and he just starts screaming at the top of his lungs like obnoxious like you know he's a he's a bad boy right now like, he's just screaming at the top of his lungs the whole time they were there and she had to have like the manager come out and help her so it was like not a quick process for them at all and he was just screaming the whole time and um bank people kept coming up and like offering him suckers and offering him stickers and i'm just thinking the kid was being bad he wasn't listening to his mom and now he's throwing a fit and he shouldn't get rewarded. And it wasn't working anyway. He was not having any of it. Like nothing helped and they left finally. Um, I was able to go to Target and return these leggings. I didn't have the receipt for them. But thankfully they can like look up the transaction using the card you paid with. And I'm like, what? I never knew that was a thing. I was so happy. So I got like my $12.99 back for that on my card. And my mom's actually getting her nails done. I'm actually with my mom. She's getting her nails done right now, and I just got me a chai tea at Starbucks. Mm. And so, I am done with what I needed to do in town today, and it stopped snowing just as we left the house, so that's awesome. So I'm just waiting for my mom to get done getting nails. I'm so jealous. These are my real nails, but like you can you can see the paint job. Um, she's getting fake nails, and I'm so jealous because I can't get fake nails. Or well, I I might be able to get fake nails, but I can't get gel polish. And there's no point in getting your nails done if you don't do gel polish because everything else just chips and gel polish is the only thing that lasts forever. Um, and I can't get it because I'm allergic to it. So. I just do my own, but there's someone walking by and they're like looking at me because I'm talking to my phone and someone pulled up right here. <laughs> so I'm going to go. I'm going to go back to where my mom's getting her nails done, see how much longer she has. Probably not long. They're pretty quick at the, the V-Tech nails. So yeah, 
and then we go home and pack. So my mom's almost done. It took way longer than she said it was gonna take. Stopped by and saw my friend Jazz. You guys might remember her. She's been on the channel a couple times. But I'm just tired and I don't wanna spend any more money. So I'm just like got this blanket as a pillow and I'm just like chillaxing in the car for probably about 10 more minutes until my mom gets here. Then I don't know where we're going. I think she wants to go to the Goodwill. She loves to thrift shop. And then she has a doctor's appointment, but I'm tired and I have to go home and pack. <laughs> so nice. I love them. Gosh, talons. I know. Okay, what now? Where are we going now? Um, food. You hungry? Oh my gosh, but. You um, still have like more than an hour until your doctor's appointment. Yeah. Stop. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Stop now. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Okay. Okay, back. Literally stopping at Panda Express again because my stepdad loves the orange chicken. And we're like six cars deep. Mom, this is gonna take forever. And after over seven hours in town, we are finally on our way home. <laughs> I'm exhausted. All that running around. Oh, okay, okay. I look like I don't, but I am excited <laughs> to go home, make some dinner. I may or may not edit today's video. I'm tired. Bye. <sighs> okay, so we had dinner, watched Boo Amidia Halloween, and now it was time for bed. <sighs> All right, guys, it is Friday morning, the last day of this week long vlog. And um, yesterday I actually forgot to mention that the vet called back about Nevaeh's blood test to see why she was still going into heat. And this blood test detects the hormone for the ovaries. So it's like, yes, there's the hormone and there's some ovary in there. Or no, there isn't the hormone. And there's no ovary in there. And then there's a teeny tiny little gray area where it's undecisive. Guess where my dog fell? In the gray area. Of course. So she has to go either for more testing or we just do the exploratory surgery and they look for the ovary pieces because the vet said it, it most likely sounds like ovary pieces versus like a vaginal infection or something because it comes and goes and it comes and goes like a heat and all the symptoms that she has are like a heat. So they are getting an estimate together for us for like each, we have like three options. Like we can do the blood test again when she's completely out of heat and then that will test for the hormone again. Or we can do another type of test when she's in heat and then they, they test like the secretion that's coming out of her vagina um, for bacteria or whatever, or something like that. Or they just go ahead and do the exploratory surgery and look and try to like find a needle in a haystack. Cause literally it could be just like the tiniest little piece of ovary that reseeded in, in her body when she was being spayed. So I'm like, I'm so upset. I just don't know what to do. These animals have cost me so much money. It was $250 just to do the blood tests. So I, what, Monday I paid $250 for it and now they want to do more tests or just do the surgery but then paying for the surgery and having that surgery and not finding it like oh my god I'm so stressed out about it Ugh. so yeah it's Friday morning and I'm out of cereal which sucks because that's what I wanted for breakfast so I'm just gonna have some yogurt and an orange and maybe a piece of peanut butter toast and I'm gonna pack all day long because it's still snowing just dumping snow um, so I'm gonna be packing up the house all day and just chillaxing since I've been doing a lot of stuff this week and yesterday I was out of the house for over seven hours and I just want to stay home I'm actually watching my sister's dog Echo she's a little puppy at Coco I'll show you guys her well she's not very little anymore but she's still considered a puppy to me and yeah just not really an exciting day so don't know how much I'm gonna be vlogging probably gonna Hop on the treadmill and watch some Netflix. And yep, just hanging out. Gonna edit because I did not edit yesterday. I did not put up a video even though I had one because I was just exhausted after getting home and cooking dinner and yeah. <laughs> Echo. Echo Coco. Echo Coco, say hi for the vlog, Echo Coco. Oh, sweet puppy girl. Hi. Hi, sweet girl. 
sweet puppy dog. Yeah, Coco. Oh, Coco and Nevaeh. Oh, sweet girl. Sweet girls. Okay, girls. Okay, girls. Calm down. Calm down. What? Quality control, watching today's video, making sure it's all good to go. So much packing. All right, doing the red cabbage test. I'm gonna boil some cabbage and then strain it and add my pee. <laughs> See if it turns red or blue, boy or girl. There's cabbage water, it's purple. Here's my pee. And it's still purple. That means girl.